Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It's currently 3 o'clock in the morning on this Tuesday, October something, and um, I'm playing Minecraft and having a cup of tea at Duncan some Vienna Fingers. Recently just rediscovered Vienna Fingers and I've been uh, eating a lot of these.
decided, if you know, I have a, a gardening channel. I have an interest in gardening, so I couldn't help but, oh, I left my door open. I made a greenhouse. And I'm growing potatoes. I've got a couple of watermelons. I got some wheat. And I got the water. So that's what I've been up to. I, there's some jack-o'-lanterns that I built. But what I'm looking to do is uh, I wanted to make well, this is what I did. I made an enchanting, what do they call it, an enchanting table. Let's go here again. Uh, what's an enchantment table? Is that what they call it? Enchantment table. Somewhere. I don't know why I can't see it. There it is, enchantment table. So, to make an enchantment table, I needed obsidian. I already had diamonds. Uh, I learned how to make a book, but I had no clue about getting obsidian. And uh, I looked at some YouTube videos. Well, I knew I needed a bookcase for one thing. Um, and I had to make some books. So I did that. I got paper from the, uh, from those um, bamboo. But what I found out, I was watching a YouTube video, and it was kind of complex because they had a pool of lava out in the open, surrounded by, you know, they built a cobblestone uh, pool holding, and I was afraid the dogs would get in there. So initially I said, well, I'll build it in the cave where the, where the lava is. So I came down here. some lava. And I did not know you could pick up lava in your bucket. Did not know that. So let's go down. Oh, another thing I did is I made a diamond pickaxe. I found out that I needed a diamond pickaxe. Everything was connected to be able to mine obsidian. So I had to I had to end up finding a couple of more diamonds. I'm not finding diamonds on a regular basis. They're very difficult for me to find. So I came down here and uh, I came down with my initial idea was to collect lava. So I tried to collect lava that was moving and it didn't work. And I said, oh, how do you if you can't collect lava. So I came over here and I tried to collect it and nothing was happening. And I'm like, what's going on? I couldn't figure out what was going on. The same thing with water. I did not know you can't collect moving water. So I was confused as to what was going on. So I came over here. Oh man, there's a lot lot going on down here. So I came down here and my plan was to build a pool and I was making it more complex than it needed to be. So I, I was building a pool like this somewhere over here. I forget where. But then just by accident I didn't read up on it I came over here and I saw, you know, I, I, I came over here and I was able to take lava. So I brought the lava over to where there was water. Throw it in and there I go, I got my obsidian. So that's when, you know, this came in 
although it takes a long time, there was, is there something else that you're supposed to use to collect obsidian? So once I had the obsidian, I could then make my enchantment table. So other than that, I have ventured way down there and have had to respawn a couple of times and collect all my stuff. But I've been looking high and low for diamonds and I can't find them. So finally what happened, oh, this is what I wanted to, I don't know if that's it or not. It's pretty cool when uh, I was going to save it, but I, I ended up doing it off camera where there was a large patch of sand and I hit it with an arrow and it all came tumbling down. That's pretty fun to do. But, so I've got these little tiny goals that come up that keep me interested. But this is the latest as I'm looking for iron, spending all this energy into iron. And I come across on YouTube how to make an iron farm. So that's my latest goal. Um, I think after that, well, what I'm going to have to learn how to do it with this iron farm after I built it is I have to collect villagers. So that's what I've been meaning to do anyways, is learn how to collect villagers. So with the first, the first um, example I came across on YouTube for an iron farm, it involved collecting the mobsters. And I guess they're standing in water. So if they're standing in water, they don't completely burn up when the sun comes up. And somehow I think that that makes lava somehow. I, I'm sorry, it makes iron. And then the iron gets collected. But uh, this, this one that I'm following, it involves putting 20. That's the thing. It's a little bit, I think it, it's, it's more involved, although it's supposed to be simpler design. You have to collect. So here is my enchantment table. And I don't have the slightest idea what to do with it. I don't know what this is. Is that a nugget? I thought it was like a, a gold nugget or something like that. I made, uh, I made an iron nugget, I think. And it didn't do anything. So I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I have no idea. But let's see. Oh, it's nighttime. So let's hit the sack here. And let me show you what I've been up to. All right. I've been using this for everything that started to deteriorate. How do you uh, repair a diamond pickaxe? Do I have to repair it with diamonds? Or can I repair it with an iron pickaxe? But anyways, what else? Oh, I left my rowboat, my rowboat out and it disappeared, I thought it was gone. And then I noticed, I noticed uh, the water was flowing this way. Oh no, that was the other game, I think. But my rowboat was gone. And then I happened to notice, oh yeah, no, it was this one. There was something sticking out of the sand and I dug into it and there was the rowboat. So it got sucked in. So I think, uh, I think the, um, the creeper blew up and caused the water to flow. And see, this is where I was gonna put some lava. 
I was going to carry lava out, but let me show you. I think I'm going to completely take down this whole mountain. I noticed there's TNT. Is that what you're supposed to do with TNT? Uh-oh. Okay, there it is. It's still there. So I made this nice and flat for the sea turtles. They seem to like that. So we'll get in the rowboat. And you know that island that I mentioned before? What is that? Why is he out during the day? Where'd he go? All right. So here is what I've been up to so far. Now, I don't know how, how do I get a perspective where I can be in the middle of the air. I, I don't know how to do that, so I've been building stuff to be able to get to the blocks I need to build. But this is what I got. So I got this platform, it's 14 by 14, and it has leaves. Another thing I just learned is you cut leaves with your shears. For some reason, I thought that was mainly for um, your beehive to collect honey. I've been chopping leaves off of oak trees forever. But you get these squares here of leaves. And uh, you, put, you put this around. And then what you do is I built an infinite source. I'm just following an instruction on a YouTube video. So this, evidently, this di diameter is an infinite water source. So now I get water. And I've been placing water over here. So i got to place some more water. Another one here. What happened to my water? I thought I collected water. sworn I collected water. So you dump water here. Notice the, the angle of the, uh, the way the water is flowing. Whoops. Got to do another one here. Man, it's going to be time consuming. island and add more uh, cobblestone. Now, the video says you have to be at least a hundred blocks. What happened to my water? Did I spill it or something? I don't understand this. I had water. What is it that I did? You have to be a hundred blocks away from another settlement for this to work. What am I doing wrong here, people? Am I spilling the water? I don't. Let's try it again. Maybe I have to wade through the water. I don't have water this time. What is going on? I thought that was 
was supposed to be infinite water. I'm going to have to collect some more water. That goes there. I'm going to have to go down. Get some more water. I thought that was described as an infinite. Why can't, why is it difficult to get water? Does this bucket wear out or something? No. three blocks over here. Get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. And I need to get more water. And you need to put one here. use 
instead of having to spend all my time um, going out looking for iron. I wonder if you can make a diamond. Uh-oh. Here's villagers. I haven't come across villagers in a long time. Oh, man, they don't like me. Oh, they don't like me for some reason. What did I do? I haven't done anything. Wow. They were mad. I haven't seen villagers in a long time. Wow. I wonder what happened. Maybe those were the guys that I attacked a long time ago. I have somewhere in here, right here, Illager Banner. I wonder if I just give that back to them. I don't know. There was a villager and I just decided what happens if I if I shoot him with an arrow. So I shot him. And they showed up for like the next time. But then I haven't seen him in months. So I wonder why why that happened again. But anyways, people. That's my latest goal, is to get this iron factory up and running. Why those guys attacked me, I don't know. But, um, uh, time to hit, hit the hay. See, I can see them out here. I used window, I used panes of glass here, but then found out that you couldn't go horizontal with the panes of glass. So I had to use the, the blocks to finish it. Where did those guys go? I don't know why they attacked me. So here's some more jack-o'-lanterns. So that's it, people. Let me, uh, let me end the video here. That's what I've been up to. And I can't wait to get that iron factory. It's going to kill me if I make that iron factory and it doesn't work because it's out on water or something. Um, again, the only requirement is that they say you have to be at least 100 blocks away from a village. I don't think I have a... Yeah. I'm not a village, right? What am I, what's my category? I have nobody working for me. It's just me, so I don't know if I qualify as a village. But that's the next thing, is to uh, make some houses with beds in them. And somehow, I guess you can turn, um, you can turn mobsters into villagers um, with spells. I think that's one of the reasons. Well, I don't know if you could do that with the enchantment. There's a certain, there's a certain spell, certain potion, I think, that I need to make. Where are the potions? I don't see. They must, I must have, I haven't made the right table yet, I guess. And then I'll be able to make potions. Well, anyways, people, let me end the video there. So... Thanks for watching. Appreciate your uh, your support. And that's another Minecraft video showing my progress. I like the greenhouse though. So thanks everyone for your comments. And until next video, thanks for watching. Bye. I might watch the sun come up as I'm trying to complete this this project. <laughs>